Simpson was a German company which produced firearms, automobiles, bicycles and motorcycles, and mopeds. Under the Third Reich, the factory was taken from the Jewish Simpson family, and was renamed several times under Nazi and later communist control. The Simpson name was reintroduced as a brand name for mopeds produced at the factory in the former German Democratic Republic GDR. Simpson mopeds were then produced in Seoul, Germany, until 2002. Topic: History. Topic 1854 to 1933. In 1854, the brothers Lobb and Moses Simpson bought one third of a steel hammer works in Seoul, Germany. The production of carbon steel began and the firm Simpson & Co. was founded in 1856. The factory produced guns and gun barrels in the years following. In 1871 the first steam engine started its service and the enterprise established production of bicycles in 1896, which was followed by the start of automobile production in 1907. The Simpson Super Racing Car is famous. In World War I, Simpson produced Mauser Gewehr 98 rifles for the German army. In the aftermath of the war and the Treaty of Versailles, the reorganized Reichswehr was allowed to buy new handguns from only one company, so as to limit the ability of the German arms industry to recover. Larger manufacturers such as DWM were passed over in favor of Simpson precisely because of its lower production capacity, and as such Simpson was the sole producer of military contract Luger pistols from 1925 to 1934. Simpson made about 12,000 Lugers in this period. Simpson also was responsible for repairing and refurbishing existing firearms of the Reichswehr, though DWM was employed in the capacity as well, in contravention of the Treaty of Versailles. In addition to Lugers, Simpson also repaired and refurbished Gewehr 98 and Carabiner 98B rifles, MG08 machine guns and MP18 submachine guns. In the 1920s Simpson also produced .25 ACP Westentischenpistolen vest pocket pistols, for commercial sale. Until 1989 this was Simpson's only venture into commercial handgun production. These pistols were available in two almost identical models, the first known as Model 1 in German and Model 1922 in the United States, and the second as Model 2 in Germany and Model 1927 in the U.S. Simpson built cars from 1914 to 1915 and from 1919 until 1934. Its 1914 models had four-cylinder engines and were the 1.5-liter, 22-bhp Model A and 2.6-liter, 28-bhp Model C. In the First World War Simpson stopped car production in 1915. In 1919 Simpson resumed car production with a new four-cylinder range, the 1.6-liter, 22-bhp model Bow, 1.6-liter, 40-bhp model Co and 3.5-liter, 45-bhp model D. Top speeds were 80 km per hour 50 miles per hour for the Co and 90 km per hour 56 miles per hour for the D. In 1923 Simpson replaced Replaced the D with the 3.6 liter, 65 bhp Model F, which was Simpson's first 100 km per hour production model. In 1924, completely revised its range of cars and gave them the Simpson Supra name. The hand built models starting at that time and designed by Paul Hens were particularly noteworthy. The first Supra models were the S and the S Sport, which had a four-cylinder, two-liter, long-stroke, DOHC engine. The S produced 50 bhp and had a 120 km per hour 75 miles per hour top speed. The S Sport produced 60 to 80 bhp giving it a top speed of more than 140 km per hour 87 miles per hour. 
In 1925 a SOHC SO version was introduced that produced 40 bhp and had a top speed of only 100 km per hour 62 miles per hour. The S and S Sport were discontinued in 1926, so production continued until 1929. In 1925 Simpson introduced its first six-cylinder car, the Model J. Its SOHC, 3.1-liter engine produced 60 bhp, giving it a 95 km per hour 59 miles per hour top speed. In 1926 this was succeeded by the Model R, which produced similar performance with an OHV pushrod engine. In 1931 the Model J was succeeded by the Model RJ, in which the six-cylinder engine had a larger bore giving it 3.3 liters displacement and 70 bhp. In the same year Simpson introduced the first and only eight-cylinder Supra, the Model A its engine shared the RJ's long-stroke dimensions of 79.5 by 115 mm, giving it 4.7 liters displacement. This produced 90 bhp and gave a 120 km per hour 75 miles per hour top speed. Models RJ and A were produced until 1934. From 1930 Simpson also made prams. Topic 1934 to 48 Hitler's government forced the Jewish Simpson family to flee the country in 1936. Under the dispossession of Jewish industrialists a trustee took control of the firm, and so by merger with other factories the Berlin Suler Waffen und Fahrzeugwerk BSW was formed. In the same year the factory produced its first motorcycle, the BSW 98, which had a 98cc engine and two-speed transmission. Critics of the Nazi government suggested a different meaning for the BSW initials, bis Simpson Wiederkommt, until Simpson returns. After the Simpson brothers were exiled the factory increased weapons production. From 1939 the company was called Gustloff Werk, Waffenwerk Suhl, named after assassinated Swiss Nazi Wilhelm Gustloff, and had subsidiaries such as the Otto Eberhardt Patronenfabrik. Otto Eberhardt Cartridge Factory, as well as the main works in Seoul, the Gustloff work had branch factories at Greis in Thuringia and at Lodz in Nazi-occupied Poland. Sachs engined motorcycles from 47 cc to 123 cc were made within the Gustloff Group from about 1934 until about 1940. Gustloff work products included 7.92 mm caliber Panzerbüchse 39 anti tank rifles, 7.92 mm caliber MG 42 machine guns, gun carriages for 20 mm caliber Flak 38 anti aircraft guns and various calibers of small arms ammunition. The firm continued to build bicycles, weapons and cars until 1945. In 1946, by order of the Soviet military administration in Germany the manufacturing plant was partially dismantled and transported to the Soviet Union USSR as part of the Soviet reparations program for the damage inflicted on the USSR by Germany in the Second World War. In 1947 the factory was integrated into the Soviet Sojetish Oktyungsgesellschaft Autowello SAG Autowello or Soviet Avtovelo Company Limited. Avtovelo or Avtovelo is a Russian portmanteau word derived from Avtomobile Avtomobile. Topic. Car and Velocipad Velocipad bicycle. It was adopted because initially all production was for export to the USSR. Topic 1949-62, four-stroke motorcycles. Topic 250cc road models. 
Later, the USSR handed control of the factory to the German Democratic Republic DDR and in 1952 it was renamed Volkseigener Betrieb Fahrzeug und Gerätwerk Simpson Suhl. Production of sporting guns, prams and bicycles slowly resumed, but the main focus was again on making motorcycles. Between 1949 and 1962 the Sewell factory produced more than 209,000 four-stroke motorcycles. They were designated 425, derived from the fact that they had a four-stroke engine with 250 cc displacement. The 425 has overhead valves in AV formation, has a four-speed transmission, shaft final drive and has a duplex cradle frame. It earned a high reputation in the Eastern Bloc countries. The motorcycles were branded AWO an abbreviation of from 1949 until 1955, when the Simpson name was revived. Some had Stoy sidecars fitted, and a Stoy Campy luggage trailer could also be fitted. The original 425 model had plunger rear suspension, a 6.7, 1 compression ratio, produced 12 bhp and had a top speed of 100 km per hour, 62 miles per hour. It had 19 in 480 mm wheels with half-width drum brakes. The first 1,000 machines were built from July 1949 until December 1950, and all were exported to the USSR. The model was released to the DDR domestic market in 1951. The plunger framed model was designated AWO 425 from 1949 until 1955 and Simpson 425T from 1955 until 1960. The T stands for touring to distinguish it from the Simpson 425S sport model introduced in 1955. The plunger model was made from 1949 until 1960 and a total of 124,000 were built. The 425S had a twin shock swinging arm rear suspension and a top speed of 110 km per hour, 68 miles per hour. It had 18 in 460 mm wheels with 180 mm 7.1 in full width drum brakes to give it better acceleration and braking than the plunger model. Initially the 425S had 7.2, 1 compression and produced 14 bhp, in 1961 this was increased to 8.3, 1 which increased power output to 15.5 bhp. Simpson made the 425S from 1955 until 1962 and a total of 85,000 were built. Topic: 250cc and 350cc competition models. Several competition versions of the 425 were built. In 1953 a racing version of the plunger framed model was produced as the AWO 425R it was not offered for sale to the public and only 15 examples were built. Power output from the race tuned version of the pushrod overhead valve engine was 24 bhp. A version with chain driven double overhead camshafts appeared in 1955 and produced about 28 bhp. By 1958 Simpson's racing team found it necessary to switch from shaft drive to chain drive, which meant that it had to develop a new engine as well. For the 1958 season the Simpson single had a telescopic front fork and swingarm rear suspension, alongside the fast and proven single-cylinder engine, Simpson also developed a 250cc parallel twin. It had long stroke dimensions of 50.5 mm by 56 mm and produced more than 30 bhp at 10,000 revolutions per minute. Like the single, the twins valves were in AV formation and it had a six-speed transmission and chain final drive. 
The twin made its first appearance in 1958 with chain-driven double overhead camshafts, but for the following season the engine was revised with shaft-driven overhead cams. Simpson developed a new motorcycle frame for racing, with a leading link front suspension and long swingarm rear suspension. The twin proved to be fast but was plagued with teething troubles. In road racing in the 1950s, MZ won numerous international victories, but Simpson's wins were confined to domestic competition. Simpson won the DDR Meisterschaft GDR Championship in 1953, 1954, and 1955, but in 1958, the Allgemeiner Deutscher Motorsport Verband. ADMV General German Motorsport Federation decided that in the 1959 season works riders would not be allowed to compete in the national championship. Simpson therefore withdrew from road racing for 1959, a Gellensport Enduro version of the swinging arm framed S model. The Simpson 425 GS was introduced in 1957. Production continued until 1959 and a total of about 80 examples were built. Simpson developed a version of its single-cylinder engine enlarged to 350 cc for enduro and motocross competition. The enlarged GS engine produced such good performance that Simpson decided to make it in larger numbers for competition machines to sell to club riders. In its first years of competition the GS suffered numerous competition defeats, but Simpson systematically improved the reliability of its works competition machines. By the time Simpson four-stroke production was ended at the end of 1961, the Simpson Works team had won competitions both in the DDR and abroad, and because of its competitiveness and reliability the GS model was used to equip the DDR's national six days trial team. Topic. 350cc road models. The Simpson Escorte was a limited production model built in 1957 for the DDR's Ministerium des Innern MDI or Ministry of the Interior and for the Volkspolizei. The Escorte looks identical to the 425S but has a 350cc engine based on that of the GS. It produced 23 bhp, which gave a top speed of 130 km per hour 81 miles per hour. Only about 30 were built. Production of the plunger suspension 425T model had ended in 1960, and in 1961 Simpson planned a 20 bhp, 350cc, swinging arm model for the general market. The prototype had a partially enclosed rear wheel and two-tone paint scheme reminiscent of some Norton models of that time, and a handlebar cladding a little like MZ models of the era and a neat headlamp nacelle. It was equipped with integral indicators, which was a relatively advanced feature for European motorcycles in 1961. However, in the development phase of this model the DDR introduced a policy of bundling capacity concentration, under which the production of larger motorcycles would be concentrated at the MZ works at Zschopau and from January 1962 all new private cars and motorcycles would be two strokes. The DDR's Volkswirtschaftrat, People's Economic Council, terminated Simpson four-stroke manufacture on 31 December 1961. Topic: 1955 to 90 two-stroke motorcycles and mopeds. In 1955, the year that the 425S motorcycle was launched and the Simpson brand name was restored, the factory also began making two-stroke mopeds. The first model was the State Route One, a 48cc machine producing 1.5 bhp. This was succeeded by the State Route 2 in 1957 and the State Route 2 East in 1959. 
In 1958 Simpson launched the KR-50, which has integral leg shields and a rear wheel enclosure like a motor scooter, but 16-inch wheels like a small motorcycle. The KR-50 had a 48cc motor like the Senior Series, but with a higher compression ratio that increased power output to 2.1 bhp. When four-stroke motorcycle production was terminated, the Simpson factory was directed to concentrate on moped production. In 1963 it raised the KR-50's compression ratio to 8.5.1, which increased power to 2.3 bhp. In 1964 this model was succeeded by the KR-51 Schwalbe Swallow, in which the KR-50's 38 by 42 mm long stroke engine was revised with almost square dimensions of 39.5 by 40 mm and 50 cc displacement. Compression was raised again to 9.5.1, increasing power by almost 50% to 3.4 bhp. Moped production grew steadily in Seoul, up to 200,000 mopeds were built per year. In 1965 the Simpson factory employed 4,000 workers, in 1964 Simpson launched the State Route 4-1 Spats, Sparrow, and State Route 4-2 Star, each of which had motorcycle-style bodywork without the leg shields and rear enclosure. The Spats initially had the long stroke 38 by 42 mm engine and an 8.5, 1 compression ratio and produced 2 bhp. The Star had an over square 40 by 39.5 mm engine with 9.5, 1 compression and produced 3.4 bhp. In 1967 the SPATS was revised as the State Route 4-1 SK, which shared the STARS 40 by 39.5 mm engine dimensions but had an 8.5, 1 compression ratio and produced 2.3 bhp. SPATS production was ended in 1970 and STAR production was ended in 1975. In 1966 Simpson introduced the State Route 4-3 Sperber. Sparrowhawk, with the same 50cc engine but with power increased to 4.6 bhp and more angular styling than the Spats and Star. In 1971 Simpson introduced the State Route 4-4 Habicht, Hawk, which was cosmetically the same as the Habicht but had the same 3.4 bhp power output as the Star. Sperber production was ended in 1972 and Habicht production continued until 1975. In 1968, Simpson was merged with VEB Ernst Thalmann Werk Sewell to form the VEB Fahrzeug und Jagdwaffenwerk Ernst Thalmann Sewell. The Schwalb helped the company to worldwide fame, and in the DDR, the scooter stood for the success of East German two wheeler motor manufacturing. The Schwalb was slowly developed over the years. In 1968 the KR 51 over 1 series was introduced with power increased to 3.6 bhp, followed in 1979 by the KR 51 halves series with 3.7 bhp. Schwalb production was ended in 1986 in favor of more modern Simpson 50cc moped models. In 1970 Simpson introduced a bicycle-style, pedal-start moped, the 50cc, 1.6 bhp SL1 MOFA. MOFA is a contraction of motor farad, German for moped. The model was revised as the SL1s in 1971 but was discontinued in 1972. In 1975 Simpson revised its image with a new model, the S50. This used the 40 by 39.5 cc version of the Simpson engine, produced 3.6 bhp and was produced in various versions until 1980. Its successor was the S51, in which Simpson revised the styling again and returned to a long stroke engine, this time with 38 by 44 mm dimensions and a 3.7 bhp output. 
The S-51 was built in various forms until production was ended in 1990. In 1983 Simpson introduced a 70cc model, the S-70. This had the S-51's long-stroke engine bored out by 7 mm, giving over square dimensions of 45 by 44 mm and producing 5.6 bhp. Like the S-51, the S-70 was produced in various forms until 1990. In 1986 Simpson introduced a new 50cc scooter, the State Route 50. It had leg shields and unlike the KR-50 and KR-51 it had scooter-sized 12-inch wheels. However, it had a motorcycle-style rear mudguard instead of a scooter-style rear enclosure. In 1987 a 70cc version, the State Route 80 was added to the range. The State Route 50 and State Route 80 were made in various versions until 1990. 1990–2002 After East Germany's peaceful revolution in 1989 and German reunification in 1990, a number of attempts to modernize the assembly lines were made. This included commercial production of Makarov PM pistols, which the factory had previously made under the Ernst Thälmann name for DDR Nationale Volksarmee National People's Army and police use. Fewer than 1,000 commercial Makarovs were made under the Simpson name before production was discontinued. In 1990, the S51 and S70 models were revised as the 50cc S53 and 70cc S83. These were offered in a range of road going and off road versions, but total production of all versions from 1990 until 1994 was only about 10,500 machines. In 1992, Simpson resumed tricycle production with a 50cc, 3.3 bhp model, the SD50 Lieutenant. It is based on the State Route 50 scooter but has a single seat with a 360-liter cargo space behind it. From 1994 the model was named the Albatross. Production continued until 2002. In 1993 the Sewell factory began making the Hotzenblitz electric car under contract for Hotzenblitz Mobile GmbH & Co. KG of Ibach in Baden-Württemberg. Hotzenblitz is a portmanteau word derived from the Hotzenwald region of the southern Black Forest around Ibach and Blitz, German for lightning. The car had two seats and weighed 780 kilograms 1,720 pounds. It produced only 16 bhp and had a range of only 100 kilometers 62 miles to 150 kilometers 93 miles. The car was a very limited success, and only 140 examples were built by the time production was ended in 1996. In 1993 the State Route 50 and State Route 80 scooters were revived. By 1997 revived production of the Senior Series totaled 3,100 examples, and production continued until 2002. In 1994 the S53 and S83 were revised with two versions each, the road-going alpha and off-road beta. These were made until 1996 but production figures are unavailable. In 1996 Simpson revived the star model name for a new 50cc scooter that had more curvaceous, fully enclosed bodywork. Production of this model continued until 2001. In 1996, Simpson renamed the Alpha and Beta range by reviving the Habicht model name. In 1997, it introduced a 5.1 bhp version of the 50cc machine, for which it revived the model Sperber name. In 1999 new 50cc models were introduced, the Sperber Sport with a sports full fairing and a new Spatz with a space frame. Further 50cc models were the semi-off-road fighter in 2000 and the SC and TS series in 2002. In 1998 Simpson introduced a 125cc model, the Shikra. Shikra is a type of goshawk. 
The machine has a space frame and is powered by a Honda 4-stroke 15 bhp engine built under license in Taiwan. In 2000 the Shikra name was discontinued, power output was reduced to 13.6 bhp and the model became simply the Simpson 125. Several investors tried to keep production going and to bring new developments on market, but production finally ceased in autumn 2002. On February 1, 2003, bankruptcy proceedings were held, in the wake of which the remaining 90 employees were made redundant without any compensation. The Schwalbe has since gained cult status in Western Germany. <laughs> Notes Topic bibliography Botcher, Knut 1999 1975 Mokik S50 In Schrader Halwert Motorrader aus der DDR in German 2nd ed Stuttgart Schrader Verlag pp 116 to 122 ISBN 3-613-87176-9 Dan, Ewald 1999 Grosserienbau von Kleinkrafttradern. In Schrader, Halwert. Motorrader aus der DDR in German 2nd ed. Stuttgart, Schrader Verlag. pp. 94-103. ISBN 3-613-87176-9. Edler, Karl Heinz 1999 Die DDR Rennmaschinen 1958. In Schrader, Halwert. Motorrader aus der DDR in German 2nd ed. Stuttgart, Schrader Verlag. pp. 148-149. ISBN 3-613-87176-9. Ronicky, Frank 2009. DDR Motorrader Seat 1945. Typenkumpus in German 2nd ed. Stuttgart, Motorbuch Verlag. ISBN 978-3-613-02776-3. Schroeder, Wolfgang 2009 Die Motorrad und PKW Produktion der DDR, AWOMZ Simpson Trabant Wartburg in German, 1st ed. Bielefeld, Delius Klasing Verlag. ISBN 978-3-7688-2517-7. Seyfert, H. In Memoriam, Die Simpson Viertakter. In Schrader, Halwert. Motorrader aus der DDR in German 2nd ed. Stuttgart, Schrader Verlag. pp. 88-93. ISBN 3-613-87176-9. Seyfert, H. Schwalb, Spatz und Star, die Kleinfarzüge aus dem Veb Simpson Suhl. In Schrader, Halwert. Motorrader aus der DDR in German 2nd ed. Stuttgart, Schrader Verlag. pp. 122-132. ISBN 3-613-87176-9. Tinker, Edward B., Johnson, Graham K. 2007. Simpson Lugers, Simpson & Co., Sewell, The Weimar Years. Galesburg, Ill, Brad Simpson Publishing. ISBN 978-0-9727815-1-0. Wilson, Hugo The Encyclopedia of the Motorcycle. London, Dorling Kindersley. ISBN 0-7513-0206-6. Wise, David Burgess 1992. Encyclopedia of Automobiles. Secaucus, N.J., Wellfleet Press. p. 300. ISBN 1-55521-8083. External links 
Simpson at Curly, German. Guide to the Julia Simpson Family Collection at the Leo Back Institute, New York. Information about the Aryanization of the company in 1935.